In this video, watch as we gather feedback for the baby and his song, Carpet Burn. Dude, he had a lot of dumb shit in there. Like, that was creative. That shit go. That shit go. Man, I'd be in any mood, but I'd wake up playing a joint. <laughs> I be in the shower, hey, hey carpet burn. You, like one, <laughs> you know, cause like for a minute, the song Middle Child, uh -huh. I wake up and play that joint. I don't give a fuck, you know? Yeah, who's that? Uh, the J. Cole joint? J. Cole. I feel it. You know that, that middle child used to give me, that's one of them type of songs, you know, you could be in any mood. You could it just puts you in a good mood, you know? Yeah, dude, that makes that song makes me want to get fucked up. Just have a good day. Like if you could say anything to the baby about this song or just in general, what would you tell him? Funny as fuck and make it go hard. Like, <laughs> I love it. That's dope. Just keep doing it, bro, because that shit. Hey, go. <laughs> Got up with carpet burn. Yeah. I just can't help it, pussy good. It had me stalking her. Personally, I don't like it. It's creepy. I think it's creepy. Yeah. You're telling somebody that you're about to stalk them. Like, if I was, like, drunk, I would listen to it in a nightclub and, like, dance probably. But I didn't really care for the lyrics. I think there's a time and place for everything. So I think there is. Again, I wouldn't choose it, <laughs> but someone like, might be interested in yeah, being stalked. somebody might like it. Yeah, you know, so, some girl might think that that's cute. But, yeah, you know, work a little harder. A little I, I thought so. I was like, this. It sounded. You heard him, like his voice. His voice sound familiar, but I didn't. Yeah, nah. So this not the one for you. Huh? Not for us. He's reaching some people, obviously. You know, people like him. I've heard of him, so he's doing something right for somebody. Thinking about cuffing the hood, falling in love with her. Ah. Jokes on you, bitch. I'm closing million dollar deals, get my dick lit. Yeah. I think it's really good. You could tell, like, uh, it's very catchy. You can really dance to it and stuff like that. I've heard a few of his songs, but I've never, like, uh, listened to him, like, religiously. In a hype mood, like, with your, you're with your friends, you're dancing. Kind of like that, like, in the club. It's a good song. Keep it up. Hey, you a duck, bitch. Yeah, I'm sitting on the get some cheesecake on some bucks. It's made. Yeah, I'm the crib. Another big trial. Bubble my mix. Hey, it was good. It was catchy. I thought it was good. It was like mainstream, kind of. Like, I could see it being played everywhere and it being like a hit, a bop. I would say getting ready or like going out. It's like turn off. I, I listen to, I gotta be in a certain mood to listen to rap in the first place, but definitely like club or bar, or just like getting fucked up. Would you yeah. consider yourself a uh, baby face? Yeah. Yeah, somewhat. Say say. Okay, yeah. so if you could say anything to him, what would you tell him? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> what's, what's up? up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a good song to like vibe to. You know, like I like it. If you're looking for a beat, this is totally the right song to do. Kind of dance or like party, I guess. It's like it's a good song for that. Anywhere with your friends and you just want to let loose. Okay. I don't think so. I don't think so. That was some good music. <laughs> Keep doing what you're doing, man. <laughs> He's sexual. He's very sexual. My interpretation uh, for myself is, uh, I mean, I don't think it's good or bad, but I think music does influence the next generation. And mm. uh, being sexual, like, that's, that's what people are into, right? And that's why I feel... I don't know, I don't want to go like deep into it, but I feel like that's why women, as women, like we get treated the way we do, but then like we wonder why. Yeah, we mm. play its music and you know, because people like it. Um, it's not my favorite song, but it's not the worst song, I guess, for whoever, you know, whoever likes it. Who is it again? Sorry. The Baby. The Baby, okay. Yes. Like clubs, maybe? Like clubs right. or like hookah lounges? Because I, I work around here, so it's, it sounds like things, like that's the kind of music they would play at lounges, like that. It's not something I would listen to like being sober and I wouldn't play it myself but it's nothing against the artist or the song it's just I don't feel comfortable I mean if that's the kind of music that he likes to write or, or put out that's awesome because I, I like I write music so and I have daughters so for me it's very hard to explain but I want to like make music for my kids to grow up and like you know for them to be respected as women so if he was to have kids 
you don't yet, one day you probably will have a daughter and it's just not the kind of music that you would want her to listen to because it's gonna influence her to let guys treat her or, or you know, or say that to her and it's just not, I don't know, it's not what I like, so. Now look, there are a lot of programs. I turn down most things, but I love this bit right now. I love this program, Is My Shit Tight? 